Hello, thank you so much for clicking on this video. Whether you are new here or you've been here for a while, I appreciate you so much. Today, as you can see by the title, I will be sharing my what's in my Disneyland Baku edition. I went to Disneyland in May and this was just for the day. So I kind of have my bag pretty packed. I know some people like to carry light and some people carry a lot. Yeah, I think I'll just go ahead and jump right in. So let's start with the outside. Yes, this can zip up. I just have it opened, but this can definitely zip up. So on the outside, I've got my Stella Lou. I always have to have a back charm, always. And my hand sanitizer. I've spoken about this so many times before on my channel, but this is my go-to hand sanitizer, really. And obviously had to buy the pouch for it just so that it's easy access and I can just clip it onto the outside of my bag especially being at Disney where everyone touches everything when you go on a ride when you open a door you're just always touching things and that freaks me out so obviously need my hand sanitizer I just love how spacious this bag is and I feel like this is gonna be my primary Disney bag for a long time we're gonna go ahead and open up the bag i have my sunglasses for obvious reasons both disney's in the states are very sunny so you definitely need some sunglasses then i've got my little mermaid pouch that i got at daiso or daiso i don't know how to pronounce it i have some body spray i also have a compact mirror and three lip products i always have a red and a nude and a lip balm all i have for this pouch and yes body spray is essential at disney i also have a water bottle in here this is a 24 ounce i believe yeah 24 ounces awala i've talked about this a lot and i'm sure you've seen this on tiktok at least it's all over my feed and which is why i caved in the main reason why i got it was because the mouthpiece is covered go on water rides and things like that and i don't want any yucky things on the mouthpiece so that's why i went with this and it's 24 ounces it's insulated and it's honestly the best size in my opinion i used to pack a 32 ounce water bottle back in the day and that was just way too heavy yes you have to refill this more but every quick service window has water available i don't mind at all i'd rather have a smaller one and refill it constantly than carry a big heavy water bottle i also packed my handheld fan i didn't even get to use it when i was there the weather was perfect i feel like it's tradition at this point to always have a handheld fan you can fold this one it has three settings and i really enjoy it it's cute too then i have this pouch and i got this at target and it says target stony clover pouch and it just has my pin traders. I always have this on me whenever I go to Disney because you never know, you might find the pin of your dreams. I'm moving on to the first zip of the pouch inside. Clorox wipes, pretty self-explanatory. I have my wallet and coin pouch. I have a small Bagu reusable bag and I actually ended up using this, which was really nice. On to the next pouch, hand sanitizer wipe oh my gosh and that's it oh my gosh that's it that's all i have so i've got my portable charger and a cord this cord is really long i could definitely buy a smaller one but this is the one that i had and this is my portable charger i put stickers on it i don't recommend this one because it doesn't charge my battery all the way it just gets me by which is all i could really ask for but yes if you want something that is more powerful i would definitely do more research but this is just like a tj maxx purchase cool but yeah that concludes my what's in my bag thank you guys so much for watching and i hope to catch you in the next video let me know what you think about this video do you want to see more videos like these do you carry a bagu to disney let me know Alrighty, guys thanks for watching have a good one